What is going on guys, Bangalini here, coming back at you with another video back on the 49ers franchise. And an interesting thing for the 49ers franchise, we're going to mix it up a little bit, okay? So I was reading the feedback of the last 49ers franchise video, episode 1, technically, uh, and reactions were mixed. Some people liked it, some people didn't, some people had constructive criticism, some people had not so constructive criticism, but I think I've taken out the construct... Uh, the constru the constructive criticism. <laughs> that was way harder than I intended. Um, I think I took out the constructive criticism, and I think I'm going to turn the series into, so into something that more people are going to enjoy. And I think it was based off of one comment. It was about a week ago, but I still remember it. Um, I don't remember your name. I apologize. But if you're watching this, shout out to you. But they basically said, Bangle. We didn't subscribe for you because we wanted to tell you exactly what we're seeing on the screen. The whole, like, you know, commentary thing from a third person perspective is not what we want. We subscribe for you, right? We subscribe for your personality because you're funny, because you, you know, make the kind of videos that we're looking for. And I said, I think you mean you subscribe for rebuilds, but we'll let it slide. We are back on the 49ers franchise. I'm going to have the face cam. We're going to be live comming it. We're going to be acting as if I'm actually playing the game. Now, it's not like the franchises have done in the past, so it's going to be a little bit different. It's going to be as if I'm actually playing. People also wanted me to tweak the sliders because they said the defense was way too hard. So we're going to be doing that, and I might as well show you guys. Um, so quarterback accuracy, I think, needs to be boosted mainly, maybe a bit to a 27 uh, and 23 on here. And then pass defense reaction time is going to move down to... Interceptions is good where it is. Pass coverage can move down three. Um, and then run blocking and pass blocking need to be moved up um, to a 65. That's wide receiver catching. That's my bad. I think it was 55. Run blocking and pass blocking need to be moved up. 65 and 70 is what we're going to try. It's going to be a little bit experimental. Um, but we are 0 1. I tried out CJ Beathard, and it's a little bit, I feel like it's almost a weight lifted off my shoulders to be in this position now where I'm actually playing the games. Instead of, um, you know, just like saying what it happens, like CJ Beathard drops back to throw. It was a little bit weird, but it's like some people wanted live comm, some people wanted face cam, some people wanted realistic commentary, others didn't. We're going with this method. If you don't like it, it is what it is. Sorry. But uh, we got to take this 49ers franchise and we got to, you know, turn that frown. <laughs> Looked it upside down. We're going we're gonna to try and win here. Uh, also, top comment on the last video was, Bang, you say you could beat the on that and CPU every single time. That was with a rebuilt team. When we actually made the playoffs, there's no way I would ever lose with regular All Madden. This is All Madden on freaking steroids. This is so much harder with the sliders. It's ridiculous. Uh, also, you know, in those rebuilds, I don't have CJ Beathard, who can't complete a pass. But uh, we're going to be trying it out here. Hopefully, we can take on the Seahawks. I think it's going to be a lot of losing here in year number one. We're going to take it from a kind of a realistic standpoint still, where, like, I know some people, um, like RBT, good friend of mine on YouTube, um, he does, you know, a ton of trades in his franchise. That's not really what I want this franchise to be. I kind of want it to be more realistic in terms of what we do, and it's actually like a really long rebuild. Some people wanted the quarters uh, to be moved up, but I think especially now with live comm, it's going to be way better if we just keep the eight-minute quarter. So with that being said, the kick is underway. Robbie Gold going to launch this thing deep to Tyler Lockett, who uh, is not even going to bother returning it. I think his foot was out of bounds for the end zone. And also, what I like to do in the past was run a lot of like code suggestions, see what the, what the thing was going to run for, I guess, accuracy. But I feel like I'm just going to kind of run whatever now. And uh, see how it goes. I think it's going to be more fun for everyone involved. Um, I don't think I'm going to use her, though. Usering is tough against the CPU. There's not really a whole point to it. So we're going to take over Solomon Thomas. Hopefully make him a beast. Russell Wilson rolling out. Can we get there? Eric Reed lay the hit. It's going to be like probably a fun mix of actual commentary and my thoughts. Because I'll do this like in actual Ultimate Team uh, as well. And if you guys are excited for Ultimate Team series... All I'm saying is stay tuned. You guys remember Pack-A-Punch? We're not doing Pack-A-Punch, but we're doing another series on the channel. I'm really excited for it. I hope you guys are as well. If you follow me on Twitter, which you should, twitter.com slash Designs. I'm really active on there. If you tweet me, I'm probably going to respond to you in some manner. Um, but yeah, I've been teasing some things on there a little bit so you 
maybe already know what it's about by the time you're watching this is Russell Wilson. Please, can we contain him switching on? Jimmy Ward makes the tackle. Not before Seattle picks up the first down, though. Ugh. Here we go. Let's take over Reuben Foster. Is this a run inside? It is. I'm there. Good stop by Solomon Thomas in the backfield. The Seahawks offense has not really done much so far in the way of gashing us down the middle um, for big plays. It's kind of been pretty even. I'm trying to use her there. That's my bad. I tried to cover two people. It just wasn't going to happen. I had no help. That kind of sucks. Doug Baldwin's going to have a pretty big completion. I probably should have uh, prioritized him. But we were in a cover for one hook zone down the middle of the field. There was really no help there. I had to make a play on both, uh, and I, I chose the wrong guy. Eric Armstead injured? It means Tank Carradine's going to come in and play some football. I'm okay with that. Tank Carradine, for lack of a better term, is a tank. Ruben Foster, it's play action. I'm dropping back. He's throwing Eric Reed. I, I missed. I missed. I missed. Uh, to be fair, he would have caught it anyway. I think it probably would have been a touchdown. I felt like the only way I could come up and actually stop that from being a touchdown was laying a big boomstick, and we just could not do it. Okay, Eric Armstead has uh, torn his abdominal. That sounds extremely painful. He should be out for probably a while. So that's a good young player who is no longer on the team, pretty much, for this season. Here's Marquise Goodwin, the flash. Can't do anything. So our offense was really, really bad last time. I was trying to keep things a little bit more accurate um, to what might happen in real life, but no one was getting open. And was <laughs> Michael Bennett absolutely brutalizes Joe Staley. What? Oh my goodness, man. I, I don't even know what to do. Like, there is no time to do anything here. We're going to probably run the ball with Carlos Hyde here and still get nothing. I don't really trust Pierre Garcon in a one-on-one. -on -one. Blocks are shed immediately, and there's still nowhere to go. People are like, oh, you're not hitting the holes right. It's like, there's there's nothing. Because when I was throwing a, a few picks with C.J. Beathard, I think a few of them were really just inaccurate passes. And the other ones were bad reads. Watch. Nothing gets open. Nothing does. Like, there's, there's nothing to do. I have no time to throw the ball. Uh, we're going to just take a chance here. Give me a flag. Let's pass interference on the defense. Give me the call, please. That's offensive pass interference. I'm going to be pissed. I don't know what side of the ball we are. Okay, defensive pass interference on Deshaun Shed. I'm really cool with that because that's the only way we're going to move the ball realistically. I mean, we have absolutely no team. That's open over the middle. Aldrich Robinson drops the ball. <laughs> cool, cool. Love it. And uh, I'm going to say from the 36, it's a long field goal. It's only four yards. I really have no confidence in us getting it. And that probably was a poor read there. Uh, I just figured that C.J. Beathard would be able to fit the ball in there quickly, and he could not. It's my bad, but we are going to go for it. I usually wouldn't in franchise, but we're mixing things up a little bit. We got three slants, two going left, and we have an out. Someone make a play. You're open. Logan Paulson first down. Let's go. We have actually picked up a legitimate first down here. I am as surprised as you are. Here we go, handoff. Carlos Hyde. There's nothing open. Like, there's nothing. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I really don't. Because, um, I don't know. I feel like it's the 49ers. It's like, that might as well be the overall combined of the offensive line. Because they are vicious in terms of how bad they are. That's going to be open again, though. That was nearly intercepted. How did he get there? And hopefully one of my tight ends gets open. George Kittle's open. There's a flag. Please be holding. I'd love it. I'd love it to be holding. I totally won't freak out. I totally won't. I promise. Holding on the offense. Like, that's ridiculous. Zane Beatles. Piece of shit. Kyle Juszczyk in a check into the game. check. Said that to piss somebody off, but then I'm like, he's going to correct me again. Please, please. I, 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 I tried to throw it. Because he was over the line. I said I was saying use check all last game, and someone's like, it's pronounced use check. Yeah, I'm fucking saying it. Alright, here we go. Wind is nine miles per hour to the right. Can we hit this early? Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Made it. Let's go. We're only down by four. Robbie Gold, former Chicago Bear, former New York Giant. What a beast. Look at that kick. Beautiful for him. And then almost double perfects there on the kickoff. That's when I really shine. 
on the kickoff, I'm booming that thing each time. Field goals, extra points, a little bit more shaky. A little bit more shaky. All right, here we go. Let's play somewhat mistake-free football. We're going to pinch the line. It's going to be a handoff to the left. Try to make a play. Please, please, dude, he's, there's literally juking out everyone. Thomas Rawls is the second coming of Jesus Christ. What is that? Hand off to the left. I'm there. I'm there. Good tackle, Solomon Thomas. I still can't get a tackle with Ruben Foster to save my life. But uh, Solomon Thomas came up and made a really, really good play. I'm hoping that he comes out as a real star in this series. I'm going to start building up some storylines and shit. I mean, we're going to have a good time here. Second and 13. Please don't run the ball. He's running the ball. I'm there. Dude, I'm not there. He's spinning out. I'm pressing A. Oh. Dude, I, the CPU is honestly ridiculous. In this game, like, you just do a special move, and you cannot be tackled. Like, it doesn't matter if you're the user, if you're closing in, if you're in position to make the tackle, if you're pressing A. If they're doing a special move, the user is literally inca uh, incapable of making the tackle. Incapable. Thank you. There we go. Oh, good tackle. What the... F Yo, Elvis Doomerville came all across with the right hand and just brought him down so hard. I'm blocking it. I'm not. Here's a kick, and that is curving to the right. Blair Walsh. That's unrealistic. That's what I talk about with this game. It's on Sim. I don't know how Blair Walsh isn't kicking these wide left. But I digress as Flash Goodwin returns the ball. Oh my goodness, there's space. There's not space. There was the illusion of space. A fucking MC Escher painting. Drawing, whatever the fuck. Second and ten. Here's the slant. That is picked up well. I tried to throw Y. See, Bethard just didn't even react. Bobby Wagner on the inside linebacker blitz. Was there all day. Here's third and 19. That's the San Francisco 49er offensive line, I know. Let me get hit every play. Keep coming out in the same exact formation. I feel like it looks shitty, but it's been okay. It's third and 19. We need someone to make a play. That's gonna... What? I'm, I'm going to replay. That's ridiculous. KJ Wright, a non-pass rushing outside linebacker. Literally, this, this was my timing of this. Watch Pierre Garçon and throw the ball pretty much immediately. Let's count. Let's count here from the snap. 1-1000. 2 one thousand. Two seconds and we're all... <laughs> I'm sacked. And the sack triggered from here. That's like one and a half seconds to throw the ball. Um, look at the left guard. Who the fuck is this? Who is on my team at playing left guard? Give me your name. Lakin Tomlinson. Second round piece of shit pick out of Duke. You're awful. Look at this. Look at this. He's like, hmm, Malik McDowell. We do have a center over there in Daniel Kilgore. Maybe we can help him out. Oh, KJ Wright's on the blitz. We'll watch him. We see him. We want nothing to do with it. We're going to check back to Malik McDowell. Fucking moron. Thanks for the subscription, Hype Dola. Cunt. Just kidding, you're cool, but I'm pissed. <laughs> That's ridiculous. It's a, it's a disaster out here. It is an absolute disaster. Negative nine yards of total offense for your San Francisco 49ers, and we've allowed 138. Anyone's game still here in CenturyLink. Jimmy Graham is the motion man. Here is going to be the handoff to Thomas Rawls. Someone, please, I'm spamming hit stick. I'm spamming it. It was a, it's a poor decision every time I do that. It works in online. Um, because I'm a little bit less liberal with it online, because I'm actually, like, like, I take the opponent somewhat seriously on occasion. This is not, I need to say on a defensive lineman, honestly. I did exactly what I said I wouldn't do. I switched on, I hit sticked, I whiffed. <sighs> Hope you guys are enjoying the game, man. I'm having a great time. Pinch the line. Someone make a play. Tank Carradine, make a play. Oh my god, we're, we're so bad. Look at Ruben Foster, though. Keeping that in the backfield for no gain. Third and five. Going to be about two minutes and ten seconds to play after the snap. Here we go. We got quick release to Forrest Buckner for the sack. Let's go. He's been playing really well in real life, too, and there's an injury. DeForest Buckner got up real quick. So did Russell Wilson. Who got injured? Great sack, though. That's a long field goal. I guess a long field goal for Blair Walsh, though, was like 15 yards. So this is really anyone's kick here. This is not a gimme by any any means. And Blair Walsh! <laughs> you 
She looks like a fucking rat. Looks like Marquise Goodwin holds the Guinness world record for slowest attempted spin move in the world. First and ten. Just over two to play. We have the two-minute warning on our side. Um, we don't really need it. That's, that's a non-factor, to be honest. Hopefully the offensive line holds together. C.J. Beathard's going to roll out. I saw someone downfield. Couldn't make the throw. We're going to throw it to Pierre Garçon. It's a shit pass. Dude, that was open. You can't tell me it wasn't. You cannot tell me it wasn't because it was. C.J. Beathard airmails it, uh, and Richard Sherman gets the interception. We're in a franchise here with a rookie quarterback with shit stats. I can't do what I would do in Ultimate Team. I can't. It's just not the same. I read the screen perfectly. I'm blocked. I'm so blocked. Made the tackle anyway. Russell Wilson, yet to have an incomplete pass on the day. Shout out to 23 quarterback accuracy. Although that shows you, like, 23 isn't, like ridiculous if he can complete every single pass that he throws it's just like the way the sliders work it's kind of weird here we go second and four it's a are you fucking shitting me right here <laughs> back to back screens dude i feel like i'm in the twilight zone i really don't want them to run the ball oh i was there that wasn't even my responsibility either jimmy graham is just a beast god User ring against the CPU is difficult. I've gotten user picks against the CPU before, not in this game. And I guess that probably was my responsibility. Um, but definitely I have in the past. Tried to bait him there. Was very, very close to doing so. Could not end up doing it. Throw me the ball. Throw me the ball. Oh, I fucked up. I don't know. Like... I don't know if that's the rain there, but, like, I just planted with Reuben Foster and could not move. Dude, all Madden is a glitch. Look at the... Oh, God. Marquise Goodwin has been electrifying all day. No one picks up a block. Just keep watching him, use check. Keep watching him. Don't bother blocking anyone until I'm fucking wrapped up, you f idiot. God. I'm getting frustrated. But it's a thing... Avoiding the sack here. Putting him upfield a bit. On the run! Bethard! Make the play, George Kittle! He did. Nah, he dropped it. And we have escaped to the second half. Only down by 17. But here's the kicker. No pun intended. We get the ball. Let's do it. Negative 13 total yards of offense on the day. We've been cooking here. It's only a matter of time. Oh, Carlos Hyde! Positive yardage! Man, that felt like more than two yards, but like... Seeing two yards was nice. I won't lie. We're in gun split close now. I don't really know this too much. I do try and run it occasionally. Um, if you'll notice on that, I'll give you guys a quick breakdown of what happened. Uh, no one was blocked. No one got open. We got sacked. Now it's third and 16. I keep going to fucking gun empty base flex. It's so shitty. I don't know why I keep doing that. Um, let's run a jailbreak screen. And either throw an interception. Um... That, nah, I don't want to do that. We're just going to run fucking verticals and and pray. Go upfield. Go upfield. Go upfield. Cliff Averill has 138 speed. Second sack of the ball game. I, I mean, there's not much I can say. I, I just don't feel like much was open. Um, and that's a great punt. From where we were, to be honest. Yeah, Bradley Pinion is hype. I don't know why. I mean, we're down by fucking 17. He just punted. Like, don't get that excited. All right, we're sending some heat now. Someone better make a play. I'm using Jimmy Ward. It's a run. It's a play action pass. We're going to sack him, though, Jimmy Ward. User sack. Look at that. Look at that. Someone make me a highlight reel of this game. I mean... <laughs> We've been making plays just all over the field. Two user sacks, because that's the only way we're going to get them, apparently. Second and 21. They will convert this first down somehow. Maybe not this play, but overall they will. Someone get him. Someone get him. He's down. So Touch him. Touch him, please. Thank you. Another user sack. And he's down. He's injured. Russell Wilson, please stay down. I hope it's AIDS. Nah, Russell Wilson's still in the game. I don't know who got injured. I keep seeing injury timeouts, and no one's ever been injured. We're over the middle. Look at the user coverage. They're going deep down the field. I'm not even bothering switching on. 
that is tipped up in the air. Intended receiver is Paul Richardson, and Russell Wilson finally throws his first incomplete pass. And believe it or not, we have forced a turnover on downs. They will be punting the ball. Here's John Ryan, actually one of the best punters in the NFL. Flash Goodwin back to return. Again, he's been electrifying all day. Maybe a total of 11 or 12 uh, yards. Maybe that's on me. There's a flag. As we were down, it's going to be a legal block in the back or a holding. Something fun. It's, uh, it's what is that, a legal block in the back? Yep. Killer Witherspoon. That was totally necessary. We were gone on that play, too. You could tell. All right, here we go. First and 10. Still throwing the ball. C.J. Beathard using his legs. Positive yardage. He's be in a deep zone. That will be really effective. That, oh my god. Okay, we're showing you guys that after here. Pick up the block. Pick up the block. God. You guys need to see this, though, because this is what I deal with all game. I know the comments people are going to be saying, bad read, whatever, whatever, whatever. Watch this cockamamie tomfoolery bullshit here from Jeremy Lane of all players. Watch his reaction time on this. What? What? Look at it in real time. Literally... Oh, you know what? Maybe not. He was trying to cover Carlos Hyde. Anyway, he looked ridiculously fast on that. Uh, and he was he would have covered both routes at the same time, I can guarantee you that. He played that. That was, that was fine. I actually don't have a problem with that. Um, just, he played that ridiculously quickly. So, I, I guess I do have a complaint with it, and it's that uh, it's too hard. I can't exactly fault him for that. I should have went down. Uh, and I chose not to. Holy shit. Oh, God, dude, they're sending 20 at me. What am I supposed to do? Stop blitzing me. It's incredibly mean. It's so incredibly mean. I'm faking it, by the way. I don't know if you noticed. Here we go. Bradley Pinion. Ugh, fuck. I'm literally spamming Y. I can't, I can't do anything. I can't. Like, there's nothing that I can do that results in a win. That, and I fucked up again. I mean, like, you gotta, you gotta try. Uh, that's 53 yards. I gotta stop switching on. That's what, that's the thing that needs to happen. Because, this has been, this has been a poor effort for me, I would say, overall. But also, there's been a lot of poppycock that's been transpiring that's out of my control but also also a lot of my fault i'm not i'm not gonna lie i've made mistakes i mean granted they would have been completions and shit either way but i've, I've let up points where it maybe only should have been 40 yard gains because i just like i got a hit stick here maybe heat seeker isn't on heat seeker definitely should be on i don't know if it's not because i feel like they're diving out of the way almost sometimes it's kind of annoying Here's the run. They shed blocks fucking immediately. I can't I can't do anything. I really can't. Like I, I don't usually complain this much. I complain. Not usually this much. This is fucking ridiculous. I can't do anything. I really can't. Literally nothing. The only thing I've been able to do is run with CJ Bathard. Oh my god. And run he is. Are we over the marker for positive yardage on the day? Tell me we're at least closer to zero. I don't know. They're not popping the stat up. But believe me, that was a huge morale boost for this team. Exactly what we needed. And we're going to do it again. This is the offense. CJ Beathard. I slid. Throw the flag. Hit <laughs> and go down. We're in the hurry up again. This is the only way we can move the ball. I'm comfortable with doing that the entire course of the game. I'm not even kidding. The game's almost over at this point. Hand off Carlos Hyde. Gain of about two or three. He's into the positive yardage for the day after that huge explosive game. Here it is. We're going to throw it up, actually. Make a play, Brent Selleck. Okay. Yeah. Negative 24 yards of offense. That's okay. That's, that's actually fucking retarded. That's not even my fault. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why. Maybe I should have let the CPU get spun out so I, I don't look as bad. Let me tell you why. And you guys definitely heard me spamming A on that one. I'm going to go back to the replay so you guys can see this. Look at me here. 
you're going to see me become the safety. No, oh, you're not. I was the safety. You're going to see me come down. At this point, I am spamming A, and he doesn't even fucking flinch, dude. What is that? They fucking high five as it comes past. I'm spamming A. Fucking tackle him. God. What am I supposed to do with that? The game doesn't want me to win. I can't fucking do anything about it. I got offensive linemen that would rather be fucking jerking each other off than playing the position. I got Eric Flowers across the entire offensive line. I got safeties that would rather give high fives and pat on the asses in the locker room and fucking slap ass than actually make a tackle. There's nothing I can do to win this game. Have I made mistakes? Undoubtedly. It's a given. I have. But, like, this game is literally out to get me. I swear, it's like EA wants me to have an aneurysm. They need a lawsuit. I swear I'm going to get people to sue on my behalf. I fucking will. <sighs> do I have to change sliders? I don't fucking know. Dude, the offensive line has not given me a hole or space to run once the entire game, the entire series so far. I can't. I have to take off with CJ Beathard. It's my only option. I'm throwing that. Throw the fucking ball. God. Dude, he, he, there's nothing I can do. I'm, a, I'm on the verge of a mental breakdown. Perhaps you can tell. Perhaps you can tell. It's our only off. It's the only way I can move the ball. I'm not even exaggerating. I don't have time. So I, like, I'm forced to step up in the pocket and make plays. Look at him go. First down. Let's go. Clock's still moving. First down. Literally, this is the only way I can move the ball. I'm not even ashamed of it anymore. Like, I kind of was, but it's like, if this is what I have to do, is this going to be a fun and exciting series? Absolutely not. But if you guys enjoy seeing me get mad at the game, and I know come, kind of, it's your fault. Shut, shut up. I don't need your shit, okay? I really don't. Oh, my God. He's gunning for me. Throw it. Who, how the fuck do you bring the ball down and throw it away and bring it back? Release the fucking ball. God. Bobby Wagner is just... Blitz, 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 blitz. He has one program. It's not play linebacker. It's a glorified hybrid defensive end playing in the middle of the field, blitzing every fucking play. Here we go. Here we go. Lob it up. Oh, it's a perfectly placed ball. First down. I don't believe it. 41 total yards of uh, passing on the day. What a perfectly thrown ball from C.J. Beathard. That's what we've been seeing all day. Absolute dimes. Receivers getting open. Exhibit A, B, and C all on that one play. First and ten. They're going to send the house. I'm ready for it. Make a miss. Make a miss. It's a dot from C.J. Beathard. Couldn't have placed it better myself. Good shit. Marquise Goodwin is, is much faster than Russell, uh, Richard Sherman. It really doesn't matter. Oh, my goodness. Just go upfield. Go upfield. Bethard places the ball wonderfully. Look at Kyle Juszczyk. First down. There's no offense. I'm going to throw it. Oh my goodness. First down to Taylor in the slot. Everyone's saying, play Trent Taylor. Play Trent Taylor. Play Trent Taylor. There he is. He's making plays. We're inside the five. Who wants to play? How am I going to turn the ball over in this situation? A streak to Aldrick Robinson. No, 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 fuck! God, I hate this fucking game! Oh, good tackle from Carlos Hyde. I, I tried to slide, he just didn't do it. Uh, if, if you guessed fumble, you win. God. <laughs> Minute and 20 to play. Handoff is going to go to Eddie Lacy. Fat Eddie, what the fuck? God, man, what am I to? What am I supposed to do there? How, dude, Eddie Lacy can't fucking fit through his doorway, let alone that hole. How does that happen? Two, one, nice audible. What an ass. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. Hope you had as much fun as I did. Hope we can come back and do this again multiple times per week. Multiple times per day, even. Maybe I'll drop 18 episodes of the 49ers franchise in one day. One for every hour that I cry. 18 hours of tears. Other two is spent in the bathtub where my crying is hid. But uh, those 18 hours of tears fill up the bathtub. So 
you know, you got to take a look at the positives. It's the little wins. We're 0-2. No one said it would be easy. We have absolutely no roster, no team, but we are going up against the 0-2 Rams here in week three in a slugfest at 825. It's prime time. It's 49ers. It's the Rams. Who would miss this for the world? I know I wouldn't because I have to fucking play. I wish I didn't have to, but I do. I'll see you in that one. Hopefully I can start pumping out these videos a little bit faster, but thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy. This shit don't run away.